Good morning my classy classy people. How y'all doing? It's Oaks Friday. It's early in the morning. I'm in the studio having a cup of coffee of course and I wanted to uh, put a small video out of uh, the veterinarians list of the Oaks and Derby horses that appeared on that list. Now thanks to one of our classy classy listeners Scotty Mack who is our ambassador of the channel and he always uh, enlightens us on things that I just didn't know about and he sent over an article and I'll put that article's link under the description below the video please go and look at it and there are several horses that are on the veterinarian list for 14 days that's going to that's entered into the Oaks and or the Derby and they have to be on the list for 14 days for one reason or another uh, one of the reasons is that the horse is unsound, that could be, or the horse is sick, or it displayed some, you know, pre-start uh, violation or circumstances in terms of that regulation in that state. What's disturbing about the uh, list is that we, the public, who supports the game, can't find out why the horse was put on the list in the first place, okay? And, um, you know, so some of the horses that are on the list, I'll go through it. You can look at the uh, article for yourself down in the description. Uh, the Kentucky Horse Racing Commission vet list, 14 days. In the Oaks, Todd Pletcher has two horses, Nest and Shahama. Both of these horses are scheduled to be released today, the day of the Oaks. Now... Why were they on the list, right? And again, the public's betting their money. Or were they on sound? Were they sick? Was it a drug deal? We don't know, and we can't find out. That's the most disturbing part. So Ness and Shahama in the Oaks for Todd Pletcher is due to come off the vet's list today. The other horse in the Oaks is Asmussen Echo Zulu, big, big favorite in the race, right? was released on May 3rd. Again, we don't know why the horse appeared on the list originally. And in the Derby, Todd Pletcher again, Mo Dongo, Mo Dongo, uh, Mo Dongo, right, uh, and Charging. Both of these horses are due to release tomorrow, Saturday, the day of the Derby. Okay, again, we don't know why they were on the list in the first place. John, uh, Ortiz, Barber Road, on the list, due to be released on the 7th. And the Japanese runner, Crown Pride, was released on April 27th. So, um, again, I just wanted to get it out there. Those are the horses. There may be more on the list. I don't know that. And I'll put the article that Scotty sent over to me down in the description. Tell me what you think. Uh, I believe that we, the public, should know when a horse is placed on the list and why. Okay, if it's because he's sick or unsound or drugs or, you know, something in their blood or urine. So, as always, stay classy. Just wanted to get that out. The vet list, Oaks, Derby. Why are these horses on the list? Let me know what you think. I wanted to make this public. Scotty, Mac, thanks a bunch for giving us the classy information. See the article under the description. Click on the link. Stay classy, folks. Enjoy your day.